all right fancy beauties and bowls welcome back to your channel this is Gina I'm not gonna be on camera today because I am busted from head to toe okay so this video is gonna cover where I am with putting a putting the apartment together okay so right now, we, we ain't going to waste no time. We're going to go ahead and get right into this here video. So I'm standing right in the doorway in the foyer area. So first, I need to bring your attention to this beautiful, 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 beautiful runner. And I picked this runner up from home goods and I just love the way that the colors are meshed together there is some shimmer of silver if you can kind of see it like right in this area right here but this runner is totally gorgeous so the next thing we'll take a look at is this area here which is my little mirror table I am going to change this out because I want to do like black framed if you know what I'm talking about so I want this to be the thin type of uh, table maybe even with the wood on top and then to have everything that's on here still on that that new table so as soon as I find that I will be happy with the foyer area so right here all I have are the uh, two balls one big one small of course these were from home goods as well this is uh, India made in India this statue, I believe this statue came from, if you can see with me, this came from Ross. This piece came from, don't give me the line, uh, I hauled this, so I'm not real sure where I picked this up from, but if you guys remember, good because I don't <laughs> but I thought that that looked really nice together the flowers came from Michaels and I haul these as well along with this vase which is I'm so in love with this vase guys seriously the mirror is old this came from Walmart so I still have it and that is going to change out as well. I'm teeter-tottering between artwork and seeing if I can find like a, a mirror, gold mirror or maybe even a round mirror. But for some reason I'm totally into round right now and uh, you guys will see uh once we get around to the other parts so i have just some little bling bling up there some flowers that came from the old house and then i put that um bowl how that i had that that came from home goods i believe and i put the other one right there the countertops, I have my coffee station right here. So everything that I need to make a cup of coffee is right in here, which is my cups and um, some other miscellaneous, but all my coffee stuff is right over in this area here. I, I did put the coffee in this canister and this area whoo it smells so good because of the coffee and because of the candle burner too and then I just have this 
uh, that I bought over um, from the old house. But first, coffee. My daughter bought this cup for me, and I love it. Coffee. Jesus and coffee. Yes, and you see how they put him first. That's the way it's supposed to go. Then just some little trinket flowers. Um, my uh, silicone mitts. The coffee maker, of course. Uh, stove. Still have this silver spoon. I have all my uh, spoons and cooking utensils in here. I have the Joy uh, sign right here. And I'll show you where I want to actually put that. The toaster, which I uh, think I'm going to get a new toaster. Just the little candle burner that came from Walmart. And I'm not sure what candle I have burning right now. On this side of the counter is the home sign. And then these vases, you guys probably remember me hauling those. The paper towel, of course. Soap hand soap and sanitizer in there um, sponge holder cookies cereal these canisters came from Burks uh, da, 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 da. so yeah give you a look at it from this way Let's take a look in the laundry room. And I'm washing right now. There's Macy. <laughs> um, I'm washing clothes so the dryer is going. Still somewhat organized. I'm going to get a little deeper with it because I want to get some um, wall hangers for the broom mop and all that stuff. That's my work bag. Alright, let's move over, over to the uh, dining room area. The boys table is set up over there. The table, it may change. Um, I'm kind of liking the little wispiness that's going on right here. So I may keep that there. This is going to come out. Uh, my elephants, I have those up there for good luck. And you guys know the table um, situation. Uh, lace. These came from Pier 1. All this came from Pier 1. The plates came from Walmart. And I just have some champagne glasses up there just to kind of fill the space in until I find what I'm looking for. Here we have some more roundness going on. Like I said, I don't know if this is going to change or not. I like it, but then I, it's not settling well with me. This wall right here, um, I'm not going to focus on uh, so much right now because I'm waiting for a piece of furniture to come. A buffet that's going to sit over there. I may have it over there or I may move it over here. That's why I said those may go bye-bye. And then my bar cart. Uh, let's go in the living room. All right. So, uh, I ended up having to reassemble my sectional in a different way because of the space that I'm working with here in the uh, high rise. So, instead of the normal way, which would be the L, I made it into like a horseshoe type of deal if you want to say it like that so I like it like this it's giving me a lot of room um yeah so I kind of like it this way I ended up finding two more pillows like these 
at Home Goods and honey, you should have seen me flying over there to get those pillows. <laughs> so uh, I'm now satisfied with the pillow situation. And I wanted to have it nice and cozy. So I added those fluffy pillows in there on both ends over there. And then I just popped that cream color in there just to kind of break up the gray that's going on. We have this situation right here. I like it. It's complementing the pillows, of course, and adding a nice little pop of color. I like having that mustard um, throw as well as the white one. This table is going to go bye-bye and that piece of furniture is on back order as well. On the wall, I just have that mirror all by her lonesome and I'm waiting to see exactly what I want up here. Um, because I do have a larger mirror that looks like this one and it too is on back order. The rug that I have in here is this one and it's the same one that I have in the dining room. So this came from, how did I get these? Oh, these came from Big Lots. Over here, um, I ended up getting another television. So that is, a, I think, a 75 or either 80 up there. And I needed that to fill in that space because that's a pretty large space. This piece of furniture right here is going to go bye-bye because when they delivered it, they delivered it and broke it or it came broke from wherever it came from but it's going bye bye which was a good thing because now I can go larger so that's a 60 inch and I'm moving into a 72 inch I believe so on top of it the only thing that I have up here is uh, these vases which I hauled that I hauled the little monkey and some greenery this is going to change out as well I'm going to put the I'm going to put the um, I'm going to I'm going to put the cable hiders for the quartz all right guys sorry about that but Macy get the fussing because she heard another dog so right beside here I just stuck that vase over there it was in my room on top of the uh, buffet but I had to take it down because the TV took up the space and then over here, I just have uh, some throws in there, so you can cuddle on on the cat on the sofa on the sectional. <laughs> so uh, when you watch your movies, the boys' room, I literally just did this today, and I apologize for the light in here. Hold on, matter of fact, let me open the blinds. give us that beautiful daylight <laughs> okay so coming in the door um, I changed the room this way and I love it this is the way that I actually envisioned it so I'm glad that I changed it originally I had this going this way so you didn't have a lot of space. They didn't have a lot of space to get through to go to that bathroom. So we we fixed that. And then they have their trampoline, the little uh or as should I say the big teddy bear. 
and there's another for the other boy for my other baby boy and they have their te television mounted as well I still have yet to do the cords in here and then I have their toys in that bin right there they had three bins of toys and I took care of all of that today in the closet it's much better than it was um, I like to keep the bike up there just so that they're not trying to ride it inside the house because ain't nobody got time for that um, I just keep their extra blankets up top Jamari's pull-ups because we're in the midst of potty training AJ's clothes are on this side Jamari's are on that side Shoes for AJ, shoes for Jamari in that bin. And then just some miscellaneous items up top. Those are my daughter's. That's my daughter's stuff right there. She been over here washing, child. Okay, so that is one way to get into their room. This is the other way to get into their room and to the bathroom. So in here, and just pardon that, I'm just uh, washing Macy's uh, kennel. I, I do that once a week, so just so it stays nice and fresh. But I took all of their toys out of here. I used to keep their toys in those uh, bins up there, but I took that out. Because I had a discussion with AJ and AJ said he wants his that he wants their room and the bathroom to be like a, a young man's bathroom. So I'm going to tackle that. That's probably going to go away more than likely. And we're going to put up um, I'll put up a fabric fabric uh, curtain instead. This rug or throw area rug, whatever you want to call it, absolutely love it. It is so, it's giving me that Indian, Bohemian mm, kind of style with the, the um, triangles and things. I really love it. And I cannot remember, I think, didn't I haul these with you guys? I think I got these from Burlington, if I'm not mistaken. But this is what their bathroom is looking like thus far. So that came over. That came over. This wall right here, I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to put right there. Uh, we're going to bring some decor in here. Um, you know, kind of frilly it up a little bit. There's Jamari's potty. So, so yeah. And then I found those mustard cur uh, towels to go with the, the area rugs. So, still have more work to do in the, in the boys' bat bathroom. So now, we're back in the Fourier area. That is my front door right there. Okay. So, let's come around this way. And let's go into the office. And there's some more roundness. Yep, I just dug down so y'all can't see me. <laughs> um, that's old. That's old. And I just put that right there, you know, just to kind of get me started with the office. And I never moved it. So this side of the room is the studio. This is for the makeup and all of that jazz. So my lights, my desk from Ikea, and then I just have some, my makeup brushes. Those have been cleaned and my mirror that's been with me for couple years now 
So I have that there. My camera that I shoot for my makeup videos. This TV came out of the living room. No, it didn't. This one came out of the my room. This one came out from my room. That's a 55 inch. My bookcase, I wanted to have it really, in, I don't know, standard, traditional looking. I don't know. Anyway, I found that statue or that sculpture from, man, I want to say Ross. Those dolphins I've had forever. I am a dolphin lover love dolphins will collect them until I can't collect anymore right now I'm on a halt some greenery just to have that into the the color scheme of things I may take this out and put more of those solid ones I'm not sure yet cuz I'm kinda not liking that um, contrast I don't like that so um, these are all my dolphins and I've collected these over the years uh, my my kids also the the little my my girls have um, given me these dolphins some of them so I like to keep these near and out so now that I have a place that is respectable and deserving of my d dolphins they can come out and play now on the second shelf I just have a couple books I still I got Michelle Obama and uh, Alicia Keys here just a nice little flower arrangement something simple uh, miscellaneous items are are in here and in there I have my Lysol wipes so I can wipe down in here if I need to more dolphins just just random stuff guys that's it nothing spectacular some books my real estate books um, and then some thank you cards are in there so I can use those nice window I put the window treatment up and I put up 84 I'm going to go maybe a bit longer, maybe 96 if I can find some at Home Goods. If not, I may have to go online, which I don't like to do because I want to touch the curtains. I, I need to see them up close. But over here, I just have my little calendar that I can use to help me keep track of things that I need to do for the boys for myself and you know things like that on this file cabinet I have my printer which also scans and then just some miscellaneous papers there this area rug here came from I think it came from Burlington, if I'm not mistaken. This table I've had, and I just did a DIY on it again, and I just um, spray painted it. It was silver, and I just used gray. And it looks so much better. I did have the top of this with the wallpaper, but I didn't need it once I did um, some other alterations in here. Um, my desk is a little in a little disarray, but it's okay. So I just have these boxes. I told you guys I was going to put these boxes out. So I did do that. This box has uh, staplers, envelopes, things like that in there. This one has pens pencils and markers this one I'm not sure what I put in there but 
it's something that's got to do with the softest. Okay. <laughs> and then the flowers. Um, these may change out or may get bigger or something. Or it may stay the same. On this side, I have my green screen. So when I do my makeup looks, I can um, make my background whatever I want it to be. In this number, I have wigs. Baby, when I tell you, I'm going to have to go through this and get rid of. I'm going to have to go through that and get rid of. For real, for real. Alright, in this closet, and this is why I'm telling y'all I'm not done. I'm not done by a long shot. I put my shoes <laughs> This is kind of embarrassing, really. <laughs> oh, gosh. I love these. I love these. I love these. Okay, stop. Just don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Um, but this is what the situation is right now. This is what we got going on. This is all I can do. Okay, y'all don't judge me on this right here part right here, okay? This was, I told you guys when I moved in, this was my store. This is where I came and did all my decor shopping, put everything, every decor piece I had, I put it in here. This is what it's looking like after all that. I got papers up there. Flowers, pillow, clock, uh, pictures, mirror, mo mirror, mo mirror, mo stuff back there. This, all this is home decor. That's DIY stuff. Pillow. Uh, this papers. I gotta go through that. Uh, this is just bins. I used to use these for my dirty units. Um, it's wigs in there. That is a shelf. I don't know where I'm going to put, where I'm going to put that. If I'm going to put it, maybe in the boys room. Maybe. I don't know. Um, banks for all my grandbabies. Lamp. Lamp shade. Lamp. Lamp. Hair dry, more home decor, bathroom home decor, home decor mirrors. I'm giving all that stuff away. This mirror stuff, if I don't use it, it's going out of here. Uh, basket. Like, seriously? No. 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 Lampshades. Briefcase. Girl. Uh-uh. It's got to go out of here. These are the, um, these right here is what I'm going to use to uh, hide those cords. And it's real simple. All you got to do is just uh, measure out how much you need and uh, paint it. If you want to paint it, because it's paintable, and then uh, pull the backing off and put it up there. And you're done. That's it. Alright guys, so let us go to the, um, oh, I didn't, I don't know if I showed you guys that, that, um, clock up there or not, but I thought that was the most beautiful clock I've ever seen, and I got that from Home Goods. Okay, let's look at the patio. So, I just bought that table out here and put it. The chairs I got from Home Goods. That plant right there is real. That one is not, not, and not. My lights I put up here around the door. Okay. That is my storage area out there. 
and uh, yeah so that's what we're looking like in the patio and then I put the boys chairs out here too so we could chill so that's the patio I still have to find a, a bigger rug because I don't like that but that's what I had that's that's what I had all right so now we're gonna go into the last room which is the owner's suite First thing I have up is my necklace holder. I love this because it keeps me organized and I can find the piece of necklace that I want to wear quickly. Alright. A lot of things I want to do in this closet. First, um, I'm going to reorganize everything in here. But for now, I have sundresses. And then dresses, suits, pants, pantsuits, jackets, suit jackets. Up top, I have comforters. We got to figure out what we're going to do. Pillows, sweaters, all this stuff, this has got to change. It's sweaters, I believe, in those bins. Hats, that's my everyday bag right there um some little summer jumpers shorts blouses i gotta go through all of this stuff right here because i know it's time to get rid of okay on the floor on this side are boots all my winter boots that is part of a dress when i went to a wedding uh, so don't don't pay that no mind. Um, up over here, there's more comforters, and yeah, this is just ridiculous. Shoes, um, and what I'm doing, guys, is this. So I know this looks probably like a hot mess, but I needed a visual so I can see what actually how I want to do things so I and that's why it's, it's looking like this so for right now it's working because I could not keep that stuff in in the in the bins that was driving me bananas I couldn't find nothing when I got ready to go so at least this way I can see what's going on so I'm I'm seeing that maybe I want some uh, not cubicles but along those lines and I'll know what I, I'll know what it is once I see it so I'm gonna have to go online and get that what I'm looking for uh, I do like this area right here um, it's gonna have to be tidied up a little bit better than what it is right now but at least things are put up uh, because you guys know I got my little grandson he's two so he likes to stay into stuff so I put my nail polishes up there which is really workable it's workable right there these are my sunglasses um, most of them I just actually came back across um, so they're not really in any particular order at this juncture but this is what we're looking like right now as far as the sunglasses are concerned. We have nail um, stuff going on right here. All of my perfumes are here, which I kind of like this area. I actually wanted this to be in the middle of the closet. but And it's big enough to do it, but no, because then it's going to block the mirror. So, I figured I'd keep it this way uh, for now. Okay. Then, once I did that, I said, oh, okay. Maybe I want to have um, some drawers or something like that where I can kind of pull things out from. I got some ideas in my head. But it's going to take, take a while before I get this closet the way I want it. Y'all don't be looking at me and I'm jacked up. That's still my earring holder. I still love it. This is where it's going to go for now until I can figure out something else. 
because right now I don't want to put any holes in the wall and I need to leave this area open and I got to make more room okay so this is what the closet is looking like right now and I'll give you a, a look at that for you can see don't look at me <laughs> all right so coming out the closet right here is my little sitting area and that lets out into a bed my picture that I love and love see love right there look at love look at love just hanging out I love love <laughs> um just have a couple pillows over there and yes my room is basically black and white and I have those over there but it kind of cozied it up a little bit so I'm thinking I might leave it I might not we'll see the lamps here guys um, I, I'm liking these they doing okay for right now those are new they came from uh, rooms to go and I caught them on clearance so I, for right now it's cool and then I just put some little bling bling here. Alright. I'm testing something out right here. So that's why I have the gold knobs. I might take those off. And then again I might just go ahead and find something totally different. As far as uh, nightstands are concerned. This is the bed situation. Um, I know I'm going to need to get me a king size bed. You guys know that's what I want anyway. But I'm totally feeling this, this bed right here. And then I just put those pillows up. You guys probably remember those. Uh, not pillows, pictures. And then these three pillows came from Home Goods. That one and that one too. The, the black ones. This one came from Home Goods as well. There's another one over on the in the sitting area. That silver one back there, you guys know I had that already. I just put a nice little throw here just to kind of cozy up the uh, room space. If I want to do red, I can totally do red with this same comforter. And I don't even have to go and uh, buy anything. Same lamp on this side, same bling bling on that side. I left the knobs right there because I'm going to test out the um, crystal knobs and see if that will give me what I'm looking for. It's a final touch. Uh, these pictures you guys know came from Ross. I have some window treatments up. That's my mama in me. <laughs> um, I'm going to try and find some ones that drape uh, longer um, that's longer is what I'm trying to say and then I just put those pillows over there just to give it some warmth and some more pop my little flowers that came from Z Gallery the ones behind it came from Walmart you guys may remember this uh, buffet. Uh, this was a DIY. It originally was brown and came from Big Lots. I chalk painted it and then added the mirror here, here, and on the top. Right there. I have to, again, have the cords. These two, um, you guys might remember those from a while back when I went home that is Burks that's Burks that is Burks that little lady right there is from Target and then those DIY uh, books those are the wooden pieces and like I said guys the vibe I'm going for I want the um the wood, I want to keep my bling. 
some gold, some black. Just, you know, we're going to work this thing out. And then I just have my so comfy, comfy. Oh, look it, look it, look it, look it. Look it, just make your toes feel so good in there. And it's so cushy. I love that rug. And I got that from um, Bad Cop on sale, girl. All right. Let's go into the owner's bathroom. All right. So I want to kind of set a vibe for you guys with the candles, the real ones. And the not real ones. <laughs> Alright, so let's get some light. Alright, so this is what we're looking like with the lights on. I love this bathroom, you guys. I really love this bathroom. It's so freaking big. Look at the size of this dang bathroom. You see all this space? I'm literally in the doorway. This is the doorway. And this is all the room in here. All the room in here. Okay, so. Not that you've seen the size of this little monster. Nothing too much going on over here. I'm not satisfied with this area over here. I'm trying to figure out what I want right there among here. What is going to go there? Because I don't want mirror. I, I got enough mirror going on and I don't want mirror. This over here is not complete because I... I'm seeing a nice, a nice art piece, maybe black and white. We'll see. Um, but that's not going to stay this way. That will stay the way that it is. That's my lotions and things like that. So I can lotion up right when I get out of the bath, out of the shower. And then in this... It's just um, perfume, those little tester perfumes. So I can just go ahead and grab those. So candle in there. Take you out a bit. And then this is that restoration hardware kind of vibe. Even with this right here. I didn't know what it was called when I saw this. But I knew that I wanted that and I needed that to go in this bathroom. Um, also, I still have my bling in here. You guys remember this when I hauled it. I just threw a little rug down right there. One right there. And then this piece here I found at Big Lots. And I had to put it together myself. Um, but I just have towels and things like that in there. The other one, I have cleaning stuff in there. And um, my uh, foot soaker. Up here, uh, like I said, I want this to be like a little spa type of situation. This runs water. And I'll see if I can get this to come on before I go off camera. It was supposed to be on already. And then I love this. Be still and know that I am God. We have to do that every single day. Every single day. Got some greenery over here on the countertop. This, again, spa-ish. My bling. I have to have my bling, my candle some more greenery and my uh tooth care stuff over there cabinets his and hers of course 
Uh, that's my side. That's his side. <laughs> In my garden tub. This picture I've had forever, but I love it. I love the detailing and the color, really soft colors. And I think it goes perfect in here. Towels, I wanted something textured, so I picked that up. I may get a pop of color, I may not. And my Epsom salt and some shower gel. Some little um, packets of mask, face mask, so when I'm in the garden tub, I can enjoy that. My bling, really nice situation over here. And there's my pop of color. I love this color. It's not too pink and it's not too purple. It's just what I wanted. And then these, you guys remember when I hauled these, all I did was shape them and just had them to go in the direction that I wanted them to fall in. And then I incorporated the uh, pictures that I had from the old space and just brought these right in over here to give me some more peace and tranquility. These are the curtains that I have up here that um, shower rod, I got that from home goods as well the curtains actually ended up working perfectly in here so I'm gonna leave those just the way they are I need to get something or I want to get something right here to um, accent that wall space and I found this little stool at home goods as well and the beautiful, beautiful floors. So the shower is pretty nice size. So I just got my little, um, you know, cleaning stuff. What? So yeah, and my little music. So I got my music in there. And then, out we go back out to the owner's suite and we don't say master bed bedroom anymore it's called the owner's suite so yeah guys this is it this is what I am so thankful for. I just walk through a little bit just in case we miss something. Oh, the rugs in here, these came from Walmart and I thought that they added a really nice touch. Oh, I forgot to tell y'all the, the words. I want the words to go up here, right? So if you guys can tell me what I can use, I'm thinking I probably need to use the command strips, which I don't, I'm embarrassed to say, but I don't know how to use those. But um, I'll look on YouTube and uh, figure it out. But yeah, I want to put some words up here. And I think that that would look really nice. And I have to find something for this area too. Something really nice. Yeah. And we are back to the front door where that pretty runner is. So can you just imagine, can you picture that being black right there just to kind of add some dimension? I think that would look really nice. All right, you guys, thank you so much for coming by and spending some time with me and taking this little nice tour. It's uh, 
like I said, it's not complete, but we are almost there. I love you guys. Stay safe. Stay positive. Stay focused on God. And if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and click that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. Because you know what? Yes. Your girl Gina will stay loving you. I'll see you guys in the next video.